Hello avid royal watchers, welcome back to the channel. In today's news, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have collaborated with royal authors working on an explosive new book, Palace Insiders claimed last night. The Duke and Duchess are reportedly cooperating with journalists on a book provisionally entitled Thoroughly Modern Royals, The Royal World of Harry and Meghan. It is believed to paint a flattering portrait of the couple who stepped back as senior members of the royal family at the end of March. Before they moved to North America, the Sussexes said to have given an interview to the book's authors, who are both journalists, Mail Online reports. The revelation may come as a surprise to some, as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle publicly stopped cooperating with the UK's biggest tabloids. One of them is rumoured to be a Scobie, who was given details of the couple's video call to the Queen, as they wished her a happy birthday. The biography is due to be released on August 11th, and is expected to be an international bestseller. It comes as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle risked backlash from the general public with their choice of charity and its links to a self-help guru during the coronavirus pandemic. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex wore face masks as they volunteered at Project Angel Food in Los Angeles, the nonprofit behind the coronavirus fighting scheme. The project has ties to self-help guru and activist Marianne Williamson, who is a trustee of Project Angel Food. Williamson led a failed bid to land the Democrat presidential candidacy and is known for her outspoken comments. The 67-year-old even famously described herself as a bitch for God and is reportedly an acquaintance of Meghan's mum, Daria Ragland. The source told the Sunday Mirror her comments are at odds with what the Duke and Duchess believe, making the charity an odd choice for the couple. The source said she has expressed high, highly controversial views that came back to haunt her and helped her a recent bid for the White House. That's all for today's news. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next video.